Welcome to the Village of Arlington Heights Online Permit Management. This recording will guide you through the online permit management process for a permit application and will include how to view review comments, resubmit revisions, pay permit invoices, schedule inspections, and communicate with Village staff. On the Village's website and the Permits and Licensing homepage, select the link for the Citizen Self-Service Portal on the left-hand side of your screen. Log into your Citizen Self-Service account to access all your permit applications. Once logged into your Citizen Self-Service account, select Dashboard from the top menu bar. All permit applications submitted to the Village will appear on your dashboard. Any draft applications that have not yet been submitted will also appear on this page. Click View My Permits to continue. Please note, all communication with the Village can take place through the Citizen Self-Service Portal. Once an application has been submitted, the review process can begin. Under the Reviews tab from the My Permits landing page, you will be able to view the status of all completed reviews. Reviews requiring resubmittal will appear in red, reviews approved in green. Click on the arrow icon to view the rejection comments. Once all reviews are complete, a corrections report compiling all review comments will be emailed to the applicant. Please note, resubmittal will require a written disposition to each review comment. The Attachments tab on the My Permits landing page will be flagged to indicate that a resubmittal is required. Begin the resubmittal process by selecting Resubmit. Selecting Markups will allow you to view the marked up plans and to communicate with Village staff. Acknowledge that a resubmittal is required and click Next to continue. Select the files to be uploaded and click Submit to complete the resubmittal process. Additional supporting documents, including the disposition of comments, can also be uploaded at this time. The resubmitted documents will be reviewed. If additional revisions are required, the resubmittal process will repeat. Once all reviews have been completed, the submittal status will reflect approved and the permit is ready to be approved. The next step in the permit process is to pay the invoice. The invoice will be available on your dashboard and will also be sent via email. To pay the invoice, select Add to Cart. Select Go to Cart and check out to complete payment. A cashiering receipt will be sent via email. If applicable to your permit application, the next step is for the village to request bonds. The workflow will reflect once the bonds have been received and recorded. Please note that not all permit applications will require bonds. The workflow shows that all steps are complete and the permit is ready to be issued. Click the printer icon in the upper right hand corner of the My Permits landing page to view and print your permit. Now that the permit has been issued, you can begin scheduling inspections. The inspections available to be requested will show under the available actions and in the workflow. To request an inspection, select Request a date, AM or PM, and click Submit. A green check will confirm that the inspection has been requested. The inspections requested will appear in the My Inspections section of the dashboard, in the workflow, and in the Inspections tab on the My Permits landing page. The Inspections tab will show all inspections. Inspections can be canceled by selecting Cancel Inspection. Please note, the system will not allow certain inspections to be requested until the prerequisite inspections in the workflow are complete. Inspections requested will be reviewed by Village staff. Once confirmed, the Workflow and Inspections tab will be updated from Requested to Scheduled. For the inspection process, the Village inspectors will complete the scheduled inspection, results and comments can be entered in the field from a laptop or iPad, and results are visible in real time on your dashboard. A failed inspection will automatically populate re-inspection required under the Available Actions section. To view rejection comments, open the Inspections tab, select the inspection, and open the checklist to view comments. Once all prerequisite inspections are complete, final inspections can then be scheduled. Please note, failed inspections will remain in the workflow and will be shown in red, passing inspections shown in green, and the progress wheel will reflect the status of workflow. Completed items in green, in progress in blue, and not started in gray. 
Final inspections are scheduled in the same manner. Once all final inspections are approved, the progress wheel will reflect 100%. If your permit did not require a bond or a certificate of occupancy, your permit is complete. If bonds or a CO are required, the village will proceed with issuing the CO and releasing the bonds. Once the village has completed these last two steps, the workflow will update to reflect that the bonds were released and refunded. Once issued, the Certificate of Occupancy will be located in the Subrecords tab on the My Permits homepage. Congratulations, your project is complete and approved by the village. A few points on the landing page in the top menu bar in Citizen Self-Service, the My Work tab will show all applications and the calendar will show all upcoming scheduled inspections. The dashboard provides an overview of all permit activity. The More Info tab will show all information from the permit application, and at any time, you can view and update your Citizen Self-Service account information. This concludes the permit management recording. Please visit the Village website for additional information on the online permitting and licensing. Thank you.